Gulidov of Israel. He starts with a Roche that uh, was containing a little too much mustard. We'll bring you that score for the first fault just as soon as we can for Pavel Gulidov. Now to his second. So, Pavel Gulidov fine in the uh, second vault. Kasamatsu uh, one and a half. Thirteen point six five is his average. We won't be, I'm afraid, able to bring you, for technical reasons, the average. But those are the two vault scores. I'll tell you the average once they've uh, come in. So it's thirteen point six five. A 13.3 and a 14. Spot on Molnar. The vault bronze medalist at last year's junior European Championships. Already showing himself to be a very uh, elegant gymnast. Oh, my word, he was, uh, like Gulidov, rather overcooked on the Roche. But the hands didn't go down. He did take more than a couple of paces, I think. 13.55 for Botton Molnar. Execution down quite substantially. Well, that was cleanly performed, and one imagines he's going to make a pretty good case to go into the lead. The smile of a gentleman who's gone into the lead. <laughs> Bottom Molnar. 13.9 for the second vault, and that makes for an average of 13.725. There we go, confirming that. So can Christopher Mizadosh get his busy day off to a good start because he is competing in all three of the gentlemen's finals. Oh, that's good. It did take a, a little back step right at the end. That's very good vaulting from Christopher Mizarosh. Now Christopher Mizarosh, the score for him. The second vault, 13.4. The average, 13.75. And he has taken the title. And that, for Christopher Mizarosh, a wonderful outcome. Two gold medals, one in the course of a weekend classified results in the men's uh, vault competition Pavel Gulidov of Israel taking the bronze medal but on Molnar of Hungary winning the silver and his teammate Christopher Mizarosh taking the gold medal.